Not too long ago, a company reached out to me and asked me if I would like to review their Nexvu camera. It's called the Nexpod. Fancy name. For work, I do a lot with Zoom, so I thought this would be a good opportunity to see if this is a good solution for video conferencing. So if we look at their website, you can see this is the Nexpod N109. It is 1080p, currently about $300. And what makes this unique is that it does auto tracking. So if you move, it will move with you. And you can see oh, 1080p is so much less blurry than 720p. But as you'll see shortly, I'll let you decide how crisp and clear the video is. Full duplex speaker and beam forming microphone. I have no idea what that means, but that sounds pretty cool. USB connectivity, it does come with its own power cord. If you're afraid that USB won't power it, but USB powers it just fine, it does have built-in noise cancellation. Okay, so before I switch over to the next pod, so you can see what that looks like, I do want to point out, I'm using my XLR mic right now. I have my window open, so you can probably hear some noise in the background, maybe some birds chirping. Good morning, birds. That's intentional, so you can compare when I switch over in just a second to the next pod, so you can hear the noise cancellation. I don't know if you can still hear the background noise or not, but now the audio you are hearing is coming from the next pod. You should be able to hear that the audio sound is indeed a bit different. Anytime you have noise cancellation, it does some processing with the audio. So I'm not going to sound exactly the same. Also, the distance to the microphone, this XLR microphone is different as well. But as you can see, this is the video quality. Now it says 1080p, but you'll notice, maybe, as I move, the camera is moving with me. And what that means is it is doing a digital zoom into where my face part of the body is. And so the actual resolution of this screen currently is not in fact 1080p. But I can make it 1080p by turning off the AI. So this is 1080p. All the widescreen glory. Here is my mess of a recording area, my blanket, because it's kind of a bit chilly this morning. This is the best video quality you are going to get with this. I will let you decide for yourself if you think this is any good. Personally, I would go with a 4K camera, and I do know that Nexvu does have a 4K camera option. As it is like this, it is good enough quality so that you can tell what things are. I'm going to switch over to my other camera now. As I mentioned, in my office I work with Zoom a lot and I want to see if this is a good option for setting up in a room where we make Zoom calls. So I set this up, I made some test calls to test everything out. And honestly, from an audio perspective, I thought it worked really well for Zoom. The microphone picked up everything really well. The speakers get nice and loud and it's clear audio. Really happy with the audio for this setup. For the video, I do think it's a unique idea to have it track where you go, especially when there's maybe only one person in the room and it's really odd to have this wide view with just the person in the corner. That being said, 1080p is not a very high resolution if you're going to do a digital zoom on a person. So if you're looking for high quality video, you are not really going to get it with this camera. That's not really the focus of this camera. Like I mentioned before, they do have a 4K option. I've never tried it. I don't know how good it is. 
Hopefully it's better than this. I do like the overall design of it. It's really easy to press the button. It has nice audio feedback and nice LED lights. It looks pretty nice. It can work well for a video conferencing solution if you don't really care about the video quality. If you have any questions about this camera, let me know. I will try to answer it. I will have information posted below for how you could purchase it if you're interested in this or interested in other NextView products. I think they do have some different video solutions that are worth checking out. Thanks.